Hey, what's going on? Welcome back to Dazza. And today I have a selection of Tori Holub songs to react to. And one of my subscribers suggested reacting to her singing We've Only Just Begun, which is a cover of the Carpenter's song, which was absolutely incredible. And then I decided to, like, before I reacted that, I thought, let me have a look at her channel, which I do for all artists. And there wasn't really much long form on there. There was a lot more shorts. So what I'd done is decided to, I, I reacted to We've Only Just Begun on my last video. And now I'm going to do it that I'm just going to react to, uh, I think there's eight or nine of uh, short form videos that were put onto TikTok, I presume, and then brought over to YouTube. So I'm going to react to these and it's going to be eight minutes of, I, I presume eight songs, so eight minutes of eight different songs just to get an idea of what her voice is. But yeah, because there's not really much long form one now, I thought we'd do it this way. So we're going to get straight into this. So let me know in the comments down below that if you're a fan of Tori, also how to pronounce her last name, and which of which of these songs are your favourite to listen to. I'll let you know mine towards the end, but I'm looking forward to this. Her voice is incredible. I can't believe how much she sounds like Karen Carpenter is amazing. So it's going to be interesting to see how her voice differs singing songs that are not the Carpenters. Sorry, let's go. I've been so many places in my life and time. I love I've this sung song. a lot of songs, I've made some bad rhymes. I've acted out my love on stages with 10,000 people watching. But we're alone now, and I'm singing this song. I know your image of me is what I hope to be I've treated you unkindly, but darling, can't you see? There's no one more important to me Darling, can't you please see through me? Cause we're alone now and I'm singing Okay, so for the the Carpenters video that I reacted to on my channel, where it came about that I got the email about Tori, I never knew that the Carpenters actually covered the song a song for you. That I'd only ever known it from Donny Hathaway, which has sentimental value for me. If you watch that Carpenters reaction, you would know the sentimental value. Basically, I used to sing that daughter to my like, I used to sing that song to my daughter for her to go to sleep. And if I'd done that to her now, she's eight years old now. She's like, oh my God, they're just so embarrassing. Go away, leave me alone. But yeah, she used to fall asleep to a, a number of songs that I used to sing to her. And that was one of them. So that song always makes me think of my daughter. That I forgot I actually put it on. But I didn't know that the Carpenters covered that song. And I, I had no idea that Amy Winehouse has covered it as well, which I'm going to add to my list today. But yeah, this next one, I remember putting this on the list. Basically, this was my Nan's all-time favourite song. This is a song that reminds me of my Nan. I think I chose a lot of the songs on this, like, through this compilation. Basically because of sentimental value. But yeah, this was my Nan's favourite song. Will always remind me of her. Crazy, I'm crazy for feeling so lonely. I'm crazy, crazy for feeling so blue. I knew you'd love me as long as you wanted, and then someday. Leave me for somebody new. Yeah, that like like I said, it was interesting to hear her voice away from a carpenter's song. Obviously, the first one she done a song for you was a cover of the carpenters singing that song because you could tell by the she she sung it very similar to the way Karen Carpenter sung it. But yeah, I really, really, I'd like to see a full version of that song, Crazy, that cover. But yeah, that, that was my nan's favourite song. God, God bless her. That, like, it will always remind me of her. Dream a little dream of me. 
Stars shining bright above you Night breezes seem to whisper I love you Birds singing in the sycamore tree Dream a little dream of me Say nighty night and kiss me Just hold me tight and tell me you'll miss me While I'm alone and blue as can be Dream a little dream of me I really do like her voice. Stop. I won't last a day without you. That's another Carpenters song. I'm I'm like 95% sure that, yeah, I'm sure it is. That, I mean, I love the Carpenters. I grew up listening to them. That, but yeah, I'm, I'm in two minds now. I think this is another Carpenters song. Day after day, I must face a world of strangers where I don't belong. <laughs> it's, it's funny. I was like... I'm sure this is another Carpenter song. And then she sings it and then I'm thinking, that's Karen Carpenter singing. So yeah, this this has to be a Carpenter song. Her voice Strangers is incredible. Where I don't belong. I'm not that strong. It's nice to know that there's someone I can turn to. You'll always care. You're always there. When there's no Such a nice song. What's next? I'm enjoying this. She plays she plays instruments as well. When I find myself in times of trouble, Mother Mary comes to me, speaking words of wisdom, let it be. She, she said sing along. I'm, I'm glad I'm miming because I know some of the words, but I don't know all the words. So you probably see by my lips moving that like he, he has no idea what he's singing. <laughs> I know like 60% of the words to this song. I don't know why, for some reason, because I'm I'm not like I like that part at the end. Yeah, I don't know why, but for some reason, like for everything that I put on this list, and bearing in mind there's a couple on there that are like very sentimental to me, but for some reason, like the winner takes it all. When I saw this on the channel and I put it on, I was like, this is the one I'm looking forward to the most. And I don't know why, because like I wouldn't say I'm a big fan of ABBA. Like I like some of their songs. But yeah, for some reason, this one just stuck out to me the most, and I'm not sure why. So I'm I'm hoping that she delivers on what my expectations were. I don't want to talk about things we've gone through, though it's hurting me. Now it's history. I played all my cards. And that's what you've done to nothing more to say no more race to play oh, my. yeah I don't, I don't know what that I kind of wish that she'd included the chorus to that but yeah I don't know why the next song like I said to you, a lot of the songs that I put in here for, were for sentimental reasons. And up until 
a little over a year ago, Unchained Melody had no sentimental value to me at all. Every time I heard the song, I just thought of Patrick Swayze and Demi Moore from Ghost. But after my stepson passed away last year, just one random night, me and the wife was looking, uh, uh, we was on an app, and it was just telling us that what was number one the day that your, your child or this person was born? And when my stepson that passed away, the day that he was born, Unchained Melody was number one. So now every time I hear that song, I get a lump in my throat and, and I can't stop thinking about him the, every single time I hear it. Whereas before that random night, this song just reminded me of the scene from Ghost. More is to play. Sorry, we're back. I have absolutely no idea what the hell happened there. I'm on YouTube Premium and all of these are downloaded, so it shouldn't have been skipping like that. But yeah, I don't know. You wouldn't have seen it. It's got cut out anyway, but we're, we're, we're going to get through the rest of this. No more is to play. Joe, that that song now is just it hits different to what it used to it really does it's 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 amazing that how the mindset can just change completely that but a cover of it is incredible same again i would love to hear a full version of this cover i really would funny enough the next song on here yesterday by the beatles that do you remember a few a few years ago the they brought out the film about the beatles with the guy from eastenders where he, he lived in a world where there was no Beatles. Like, he woke up one day and no one had ever heard of the Beatles, so he recreated them. I can't remember the guy who sang. But I really enjoyed that movie, and my daughter sat and watched it with me, and she really got into the song yesterday. And for months, like, she had it on her playlist, and she was young at the time. She was only, like, four, maybe four at the time. And she really, really got into the song. She knows it word for word. Yesterday, all my troubles seem so far away. Now it looks as though they're here to stay. Oh, I believe in yesterday, Sunday. I'm not half the girl I used to be. There's a shadow hanging over me Oh yesterday came suddenly Why he had to go I don't know he would say I said Yes, I think this film was actually called Yesterday but yeah, my my daughter really really got into. It. I like I like a lot of the songs from the Beatles anyway. But my daughter really got into the song. Yes, I've my, still got a lump in my throat from listening to that Unchained Melody. So this is the last song now on the list, and we're we're, we're ending with a good one. You like Up My Life by Debbie Boone is it is a big song, and it has been for such a long time. I know so many people that just love this song to pieces. So I'm looking forward to this one as well. So many nights I'd sit by my window Waiting for 
someone to sing me his song. So many dreams I'd kept deep inside me, alone in the dark. But now you've come along, and you So, so that's that's the end of the video. I don't want it to go on to the next one. That that's the only thing when you watch TikTok videos or YouTube shorts that they cut too short. Basically, I know they're short form videos, but yeah, I, 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 this girl needs to bring out some long form videos. She needs to get onto YouTube and all of the songs that I've listened to through this compilation, I would listen to each and every one as a long form. That there's a couple in there that I would probably want to listen to more than others. But yeah, her voice is incredible. I it, I still can't get over how much she sounds like Karen Carpenter. But listening to her sing other songs as well, that she she has a lot of range to her voice, and it does it sounds incredible. So here's to hoping that she brings out more long form. But if she doesn't, there's there's plenty of short ones that I can do more videos like this. So we will get round to it. If there's any in particular that you want me to do on the next compilation then let me know in the comments down below and I will get that done and I will do more. And if there's any other singers out there that only really do shorts like this, then let me know because I'm always up for discovering new singers on the channel. Always. So, yeah, let me know in the comments down below. But, guys, listen, thank you all for tuning in. I hope you enjoyed this. Don't forget to hit that like and subscribe button. It really does help. And until next time, take it easy. Have a nice day. Stay safe. Be kind. See you in the next one.